Kids, I have terrible news that I need to tell you right away. It cannot wait another single second. Wait, is this recording? Hello? Am I muted? No? No? Okay. Am I talking loud enough? Maybe if I get closer. There, that's better. As I was saying, I have some truly devastating information. Our musical has been canceled. You have all worked so hard, and I was so looking forward to our dress rehearsal tonight. But now, I am so sorry to report our production of Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical, will never see the light of day. The world will never witness your interpretation of this great American classic. <laughs> I know they always say the show must go on. In this case, it can't. Ah, that's, I should go. Goodbye for now. Now, how do I hang this thing up? Siri, okay, great, that was easy. Hello? Oh, hi, Principal Brown. Yes, I know the show is canceled. What? No, the drama department can't shut down permanently. I know the musical was supposed to raise money for next year, but no, don't go. We can't get rid of the entire drama. Goodbye. Oh, the video didn't send yet? Maybe if I click this button here that says send, it will be. <sighs> Calling all cast and crew. Did you see that video? Wow, Miss Amari really does not know how to use technology. But more importantly, we can't lose the drama department. <sighs> we have to do something, no matter what obstacles we face. <sighs> Life mirrors art, and this is just like our musical. Like Bob Fosse says at the beginning of Brushes with Greatness. We don't give up. We don't give in, we burn the on, we rise again. All the we face, our biggest blow, we don't give up. Yes, this I know, we'll tell that past and change the virus to just say a word. We brush across together, we can sleep our dirty bed. Well, maybe it's not like that last part, but you know what I mean. Let me know what you think. Hello, fellow husbands. I am speaking to you from inside my closet, where I looked sleepy as soon as I heard the terrible news. I have decided to move in here amongst uh, and hide away from the world. After all, if there's no musical theater, what is the point of going outside? I will be spending the rest of my days here nestled amongst old costumes, my tap shoes, and my sign poster from last year's production of Susical, the musical. I was a great year. It wasn't right. <coughs> Don't cry for me, fellow cars, mates. I'll be fine. You'll find me here tweeting at Lynn Manuel Miranda and humming the score to Pippin to myself for the rest of eternity. Good luck with the rest of your lives. So long. Farewell. Auf Wiedersehen and goodbye. In the scene. Look. We can't just crawl into our closets. We have to bring brushes with greatness to life and save the drama program. I have an idea. You know we're all um, sending videos to each other right now. What if we do the show online just like this? I mean, if you can order Ben Platt's used tissue online, you can totally do a show on... Not that anyone would order used tissue on the internet. I know I wouldn't. That's totally ridiculous. Nobody would. Yuck. All I'm saying is that you can do a lot online. We could film ourselves and then piece the scenes together to make a full musical. We could... Oh, 
dear Evan Hansen, what have I done? Yes, this is a great idea. Not the $40 tissue, that's ridiculous. But a virtual musical is a great idea. We're performing Versus of Greatness, the dental hygiene musical, at home and can stream it online. Check it out, I could do the opening number in my living room. Ever since our mouth appeared to have some teeth, there's been a silent battle just beneath. And who fights that battle? We've well, you known them since you. Our heroes, Bob, Flossie, and Tommy, too. Come listen to the brush, 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 brushes and brightness. Musical inside you, Jeff. Brush, 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 brushes and brightness. Sit back and say hi. Amazing, right? The only problem is Miss Amari. I don't think she's gonna like this idea very much. She's pretty scared of technology. How do we get her to agree? Um, I may have an idea for how we could get Miss Amari to agree. I wrote a little something. I'm not sure if it's any good, but maybe it could help. I don't usually perform my songs, but we have to save the drama club, so here goes nothing. School is closed, the theater too. What are the actors supposed to do? How do we go on with the show? We've rehearsed, we've sung along. We know the words to every song. We're prepared, but where do we go? We go online, set the lights, fill the screen. The show must go on, the show must go online. Piece by piece, scene by scene. The show must go on, the show must go online. So dust off the webcam, yeah, make it shine. The show must go on. So, what do you think? You've got mail. That was beautiful. I must say, I am moved, deeply moved. I'll admit, at first I was hesitant, but after hearing that song, I say we go for it. The show must go on. Line, online. Please reach out to me with any questions you have about your performances or about the technology. I happen to have a Hotmail account and an AOL account. I am very connected. You all have inspired me and given me hope. Now let the dress rehearsal begin. Okay, Siri, end video. Wait, no, Siri, send. That should do it. I wonder how they found out the drama department was in danger, Mr. Whiskers. Do you know? Me either. Did you know I performed in Cats once, Mr. Whiskers? I was tremendous. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, look, Mr. Whiskers, this never sent. Siri, you troublemaker, I got this. Okay, send. So, Miss Amari sings to Cat. Good to know. Anyway, dress rehearsal. I was thinking, since we're at home, we could get creative. Like, we could do some of the toothbrushing songs in an actual bathroom using an actual toothbrush. Check it out. This could be great for the big plaque battle at the end of the show when plaque is all like... <clears throat> This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sound. And then our hero comes in to save the day, like, no way, defying cavities. Perhaps the right, defying cavities. 
the shoes that we pulled out. Good, right? Wow, that was some great toothbrushing. Amazing poem. Though I guess it was kind of hard to hear the lyrics. Well, we'll work on that later. I've been working on a plaque song in Great Gum Canyon all day. I think I figured out the perfect way to perform it at home. I've had some interruptions before, but we're all good now. This is scene three, take six. I like it, Q-U-I-E-T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How I like the lovely hush. Away from a buzzing brush. Oh, la la la, tra la la, shoo be doo 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 Quiet time for me. Yeah, da 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 Come on, Evan. We gotta go. It's time to do the dogs for a while. Oh, blah, 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 Hi, 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 guess what? I have a cat. This is Sully. He can stay and sit and um eat. He eats a lot, actually, and he sleeps a lot. I'd say he's a stellar sleeper. Also pretty great at licking things and sniffing things and um just great at being the best. I know this doesn't have anything to do with the musical, but I just wanted to show you how cute he is. Have you ever seen anything cuter than that face? That's it. Bye. So, back to the musical. It's your trusty costume designer here. Now remember, even though our costumes are at the school, we can still get creative at home. After all, it is our dress rehearsal. As we discussed last week, our base costume will be black, no logos, no design. Yes, that includes your old t-shirt, Toby. Let it go. Now. I have some suggestions for everyone. Listen up. For Tommy Two and the other toothbrushes, I want you all to take some hairbrushes and tape them to your hands like this. See, really easy. Now the other hand. Well, once you have one brush on, it does make it a little harder to get a second brush. I guess you can just hold the brushes. Just hold the brushes in your hand like so. Like you're a toothbrush with bristles. You can sing and dance easily. Though, I suppose if you have to pick something up. Uh, whatever. Just get creative, people. Don't let me down. Thanks for the costume tips. This next song is the emotional center of the story. A heart-wrenching moment where Tommy too apologizes. I reached an Audra McDonald lover performance. Now I just have to capture it on camera. Should be easy enough. Uh, well, here I go. When you look at my face, you can clearly see I need you. When you look at my heart, you can understand I can. When you take a deep look into my eyes, see a soul that never lies. My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Wow. That was, um. Well, your voice sounded great. But the camera work was a bit off. 
I have an idea that might make things easier. What if Tommy Tooth was played by an actual toothbrush? That way, you could really see their full body while they're singing. Brilliant, right? Yes, indeed. When you look at my face, you can clearly see I need you. Amazing, right? When you look at my heart, you can understand I care. What a performance! If you take a deep look into my eyes. Whoops, bad toothbrush. Uh, my face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Okay, so maybe it's not the best idea. Aww, I know, buddy. Hello, from your lighting designer. I thought I'd demonstrate some ways you can do lighting at your home. For instance, you can turn on the lights. Or turn them off. Blackout. If you have a dimmer, you can dim them. And, hmm, well, what else? Blinds. And I guess you could have some on and some off. You could use a lamp, too. And, well, that's about it. Good luck, I guess. Lights up. Spotlight on me. As you all know, the next song contains the most important information in the entire musical, which is why I'm the one demonstrating it for you, and the stakes are extremely high. If the audience misses this, the entire show will fall apart. We mustn't let that happen. So we have to be extremely clear, like so. As you ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet, I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who makes the evil forces wince. And his name is... Line! What's the line? Right, 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 right. Okay. Oh, I got it now. I'm going on. He is caring, he is caring, he is everybody's friend. And his name will live forever. I remember till the end. I met him and I've liked him ever since. And his name is... I forgot it again! Line! What's the line? Uh, got it, got it, got it, got it. Huh. And his name is... I guess we'll never know his name, will we? <laughs> this is your stage manager here. We are moments away from showtime. I just need everybody to stay calm, okay? You're gonna be fine, fine. Are you fine? I'm sure you are because calm is contagious and I am totally calm. <sighs> okay, you're all doing great, really good stuff, but I do have a few tiny little notes before we go live, okay? Okay, one, find a quiet spot to record. Two, remember your lines, especially the important ones. Three, don't sing with a toothbrush in your mouth. I am begging you. Four, Make sure the camera is pointed at your face when you are singing about your face. And for goodness sake, don't buy a $40 used tissue online. That is not about the show, but just don't do it. Okay. Oh, no. Is this happening? Oh, no. Okay, this is happening. Okay, okay. Uh, some news. It looks like Kristen Bell heard about our show somehow, and she tweeted out the link to her live performance and is hosting a virtual viewing party. And over 50,000 people have RSVP'd. That's totally fine, right? Okay, it's showtime. Ah! Hello to all of our viewers and welcome to our virtual theater. My students tell me this is being broadcast live all over the interwebs. Thank you for joining us. <clears throat> As always, I want to remind you to unwrap your candy and turn off your devices now. Oh, a message. Ah, my stage manager is telling me that you're actually watching this on your devices. So leave them on, I guess. That's neat. Anywho, some of you have been with us since the very beginning. 
since our very first production of In the Tights, a Shakespearean hip hop opera. Those were the days. And some of you are experiencing our drama club for the very first time. I wanna thank you all for your support. The drama club means so much to us and we hate the thought of losing it forever. Never mind all that. Now, without further ado, I give you Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical. Ever since an alpha group had some cheese, there's been a silent battle just between me. And who fights that battle? We've known them since you. Your heroes, Bob Flossie and Tommy, too. Uh oh, here comes the clock. I'm enamored with enamel and the guns. Gingivitis is my very test of charms. And between the two of us, we will attack. If you're lacking dental hygiene, what's your plan? Come listen to the brush, 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 brushes with greatness. A musical in San Jose. Wisdom teeth and holy molars in the back. Yeah! Great to tell the pain excitement, hold it in the Woo! Welcome to our show! Brushes with greatness. Tommy Tooth! Blood in your toothbrush? Is that you? Who's asking? It's me, Bob Flossie, your old floss pal. I haven't seen you since a deep cleaning of 92 when you banished Halitosis. She was awful. You were legendary! But that was a long time ago, Flossie. I don't clean mouths no more. I'm retired. Situation and nobody cleans like you. Plaque's too big for me now, kid. There's no hope. I give up. No, I refuse to accept that. We don't give up. We don't give in. We journey on. We cry again. Although we face our greatest. It's me, Plaque, and I think I found the perfect place to live. This mouth is amazing. Just look at all the tartar and buildup in this glorious gum canyon. Shh, do you hear that? No? That's because it's the sound of perfect silence and serenity. There's not a toothbrush or floss in sight, and I'm totally certain they aren't nearby eavesdropping. Amazing. I like it, Q-U-I-E-T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How I like the lovely hush. Away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa-la-la, tra-la-la, shubidi doo -ba -dee -dee. It's quiet time for me. This is the best. I'm so glad I banished Tommy Tooth, Bob Flossie, and the most terrible mouth cleaner of all. He must not be named. I like the food quite sugary. Yes, candy fills my heart with glee. Nothing like a sweet old snack. To give a boost to good old plaque. That's me. Forget to floss, I'm the boss. Thank you for setting me free. It's my time for me. My name is P-L-A-Q-E, I mean E-W-E, I'm working on a cavity. My favorite word of all, neglect. I strike when you least expect. Say A-D-K every day, cavity, cavity, we wish. Fine time for, fine time for, fine time for me. I cannot deny it. I love it so 
the quiet. The silence is what I enjoy. Tommy too. Did you hear what the plaque just said? As we were totally eavesdropping. Sure did, kid. Who is this he who must not be named? It sounds like he's our only hope in defeating the flock. Do you know him? Do I? Let's be ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet. I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who makes the evil for this win. And his name is Harold Rince. Harold Rince. Daring, he's daring, he is everybody's friend, and his name will live forever, I'll remember till the end. I saw him and I liked him ever since, and his name is Harold Rents, the way that you and all, that's what he does best. Harold Rents, a guy you're so brave, if Mount's the royal, he would be a prince. I'd find you here in the canine cavern. Wait, before you scamper off, just hear me out. I'm sorry about the great peanut butter on the roof of the mouth mashup of 87. I know I blamed you, but I was the one to blame. Now, we have a serious plot problem and we need your help. Please partner, I'm begging ya. Harold, I know we've been down this road before And you said you'd never work me again Yes, I know I've made mistakes It's the truth, I've caused some aches But know that you will always be my friend When you look at my face You can clearly see I need you When you look at my heart you can understand I care. Harold, I do care. If you take a deep look into my eyes, you'll see a soul that never lies. My heart, my face, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Oh, Harold, I love you too. Now let's go pulverize some plaque. Plaque, why couldn't you have stayed away for once? Harold Rins, Tommy too. Bob Flossie, the dental trifecta? You betcha, and we want you out of this mouth. Forget it. This is my turf now, and I think this tooth is ready for extraction, don't you? No, not the molar. This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sound. Leave that tooth alone. Never. And it's time for battle. Come on, team. No room to die by gravity's kiss black goodbye by gravity's This two can't be pulled out. I will go easily and neither will my friend. Gingivitis! Oh no, there's two of them. That's right, and we're gonna wreck this too. Wait, please, practice the reason. Beautiful, is not to be so beautiful. We know every morning signs are good be for you. Go, attack! Get em! We're fighting back to fight cavities. So take that flag to fight cavities. You can't be pulled out. No! They did it! Yeah, rinse and spit, pull out the gauze. There's greatness found between the jaws. Together we are safe. Incredible, truly remarkable. 
That was the best defined cavities I've seen since Adele Dazeem made her off, off, off Broadway debut. I want to thank you all for tuning in. It means the world to us and, oh goodness, I'm terribly sorry. No phones in the theater. Sorry, I should go. Thank you. Thank you all. Hello? Principal Brown. Oh, you watched? Oh, they did? They do? Thank you, that's wonderful news. Thank you for saving the drama club. Yes, of course, we'll be back next year with Greasy, the car mechanic musical. All right, talk to you later. Bye. Is this thing still recording? What is up with this technology? It's almost as if I left it on on purpose. Anywho, since I have you here, Kids, if you're watching, you were amazing. Even though you weren't together, you worked together as an ensemble and created something truly special. I am so grateful to be your teacher, and I am so glad that the show went online. To see the next episode, smash the subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified.